Mark Duncan here, asking a question. Why? Why do we need to put up with failed representation? Why do we need to put up with Morses? Why do we need to put up with less rights? Why do we need to put up with a liberal party that is merely attacking our Constitution, as well as our American citizenship? The question is, why? Well, we don't. What we need to do is we need to start standing up. We need to start uniting. We need people like myself running for offices all over each state in this nation. We need real Americans, grassroots Americans, that are willing to stand up and be heard. That are willing to fight for Americans. That's why I am part of the Americans First Party. Because we must stand for America. We must stand for our constitutional rights. And we must continue to protect them. Otherwise, there will be a time in this nation, a time real soon, where the American dream is gone. Capitalism has turned to socialism. Our American rights are sold out or subverted. And we no longer have the right to protect ourselves from even our own government. Our borders will be fall, will be gone. They'll be open for any and all people to walk through with little vetting at all. Our streets, our schools, our welfare system will all be overran by undocumented. And we as American citizens, we will continue to lose a little bit of ourselves and our rights until there is no more America. And that's the path they're going down. In order to create a one world government, they must tear down the beacon of hope, the beacon of freedom, and the beacon of independence. So, they're not doing it with a weapon. They're not doing it with a gun. They're doing it by subverting our youth. They're doing it by stripping away our rights through mandates and by taxing us out of our homes and our jobs. So please stand up. Unite, fight for your rights as Americans, run for office, run for offices all over this country. Right here in Oregon, we are a supermajority of Democrats in a liberal stronghold. We must break down those walls of liberal sanctuary. And we must build up our ranks so that we can finally start to prosper here in Oregon. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. God bless. Vote for Duncan as Oregon's next governor. Peace.